Good morning, everyone, and welcome back to another Plan With Me. This is Misty with Happy Planning with Misty, and I've got some great goodies today to show you. So, this is what I am planning on using for the new year. Um, I have not even opened it. Got both of these on Amazon. I will have them linked below. Um, in my Amazon favorites, we are going to set this up and this is going to be my, um, everyday carry things. I'm going to be scheduling for stuff every day. <clears throat> and, um, then I've got my A5 Aura Estelle that I'm going to use for my, um, social media and for scheduling um what i was going in our in my shop and then i've got um the b6 Stology, and that is going to be for my back planning so i do not think i'm going to use for sure a seven by nine planner unless it's just to show you what it looks like laid out once again my pr girl for bless your heart stickers is veronica and if you do veronica 15 you will get 15% off your order. And this is her freebie. If um, you mention her name, if you don't want to use that code, if you've got a better code, um, then you can just mention her name in notes to seller and um, just get her freebie. Okay, so let's get into this since I have not open it before i do how are you guys doing i hope you're doing good i'm excited if you can't tell because my my um thought process is coming together as far as what i want to do for planners and i'm needing to go ahead and get this open even though it's not really for right now i want to use it in 2024 but i want to get um this opened and have a look in it see what it's like and um, get some stickers made for it and get them up in my shop so I got this in the blue it's like a navy blue and this is gold embossing on it this is what the inside looks like and we are going to decorate this up so this is like a fabric feel to it um, feels very nice if you buy a Hobonichi Weeks from Amazon um, it's going to be a lot more expensive than that than this this was less than $10 y'all and it is supposedly um, the same size and that is what we're going to try out I have got three weeks worth of kits from some very well-known um, artists and we are going to try each kit we're going to try different stickers so this is from Sweet Kawaii Design and her Hobonichi Weeks this is a vinyl sticker so this you know feels like plastic this is Pookie Bear Cuties Elvira is awesome and so sweet so this is one of her Hobonichi uh, kits in the weeks and we're going to try it and then this is simply sweetly crafty and diana i um have pr'd for her before she is wonderful she's a single mom with some kiddos and so anything you can spend at her shop helps her little family so we are going to try each of these kits in this book and since this is my first laying my eyes on this for the first time um, these pages even have the color that um, the Hobonichi has so this is a cream page it's not white pages this is a year at a glance um, very similar to the year at a glance in the Hobonichi but let's see can you see this writing in the little boxes that are on there i hope you can so then we turn that page and this is what the monthly looks like 
So you would have, and I did bring, um, this is my monthly that is in my shop. And I sized this to fit a, um, the Penny Pages. Um, Destiny has awesome planners and she's in Canada and I have a Penny Pages book that I've been using, the week size, um, that I've been using for 2022. So these measurements are measured and planned off of that. And her, the Penny Pages is a coil. So if you like coil planners, um, instead of uh, book spine type planners, then you need to check out Destiny. She has some great planners. But I was going to try this layout that I already have in my shop. Now, as you can see, some of my numbers are missing because I had my cut too deep because this was when I first started printing stuff. So I don't know if this will work or not, or it might be a little longer, but... We, that's what we're going to do. We're going to lay it out and see how it ends up filling it up. And then I'm going to make the adjustments that I need to make. But this is the monthly plan for each month. And then we should be getting into some, okay, the weeks, how they're laid out. So you have a solid, um, let's see right here. Yes, this is my first week. It's undated, so I can start it whenever I want to. So, <laughs> I don't have to wait till January. And believe you me, with November and December, I have got plenty of stuff that can go in here. So, I'm going to scoot you up a little bit so you can see this is totally grid. And this is where you can lay out your to-dos and then move them. Um sort of in a bigger layout get more detailed over here on this side and so that is what you have for the rest of the year let's see what the end of the book looks like okay you have some note pages back here so this would be great to um decorate especially for thanksgiving and december but to if you need a shopping list or a menu for Thanksgiving. I think I'll, um, I think I'm going to fix me a full page up to where, a full sticker to where I can lay a full sticker down here for like a Thanksgiving menu. So we'll see, but it is held together by twine. It is stitched. And so that is the way this book looks. I'm so excited. <laughs> okay, so this is a Hobonichi Cousin cover. Not a Hobonichi Cousin, a Hobonichi Weeks cover that I got from Amazon. I buy it from Amazon, but it's actually subbed from Sunsets and Scribbles. So, thank you so much, Sunset and Scribbles, for your shop that's on Amazon. I'm going to have this linked below also in my Amazon favorites. So this is the thank you card for the purchase by Sunset and Scribbles. And for supporting um, the small business. And then vinyl care. Um, if you need to clean it, if it gets something on it. But since this um, binding was um, a cloth. I wanted something that would protect it. We've got Sunset and Scribbles, their um, emblem on the inside. And this one is just hearts that I got on it. So let's see how this fits in, in our book. Come back here. Or see how our book fits in here. That's good. That's good, good, good. So, also, sometimes when you're dealing with plastic, you can, <laughs> I learned this later, 
you can get your hair dryer and heat it up and stretch it out. Um, it comes with a little pocket back here and a pin loop. And it comes with a little pocket up front. And you want it to fit nice and tight so there's not a lot of slipping around. Guess I'm gonna have to get my hair dryer a hold of you. And I've got it laying to the side in case I needed to. So don't push it. Okay, y'all. It is in there. Look at that, ain't that pretty? You got some little tassels to mark if you want your tassels. You can buy these things called crimpers that you can put on the end of tassels. You can get them from Amazon um, if you want to hang charms off the bottom of this. So we might have to look into that too. So this might have to be trained a little bit. And let me see, I think I grabbed me a, hang on just a minute. Okay, I had to find where I, get, I had my, clip but while I'm working in it right now um, I got me a clip and this come from Amazon too so I could clip it down until I get my um, pages trained so I am going to start with a monthly I'm not sure yet how I'm gonna do this I gotta think about it I'm not sure on this um, well, let's see. Let's decorate some before I... Because I want to be able to separate... Let's see here. Here's the monthly. Where's the week start? Right here. So... I was going to do a tip-in of some vellum where everything separates. So, let's see. This is some vellum that I printed myself. So, I've got these colors here. And, let's see. I think I might go with this one first. Would vellum be something that y'all would even want to buy if I added it to my shop? I think I'm going to tip it in right here. So, let me scoot my coffee back before I spill it everywhere. So, I'm going to just mark where we need to cut. For this to fit in and then I need to do that and then I think I'm gonna get some tabs so we can tab this up so hang on just a minute okay guys I grabbed my little cutter and um I also grabbed This from Shine Sticker Studio, it's, I think, going to fit just perfectly right there. And then this is something I made myself. Um, these are available if you want your name. And so I think I'm going to put these on there. So let's just see. I also found this, and this is Sweet Bean Plans. It's cute. I just play around with some stuff. So go back to this here. We're gonna. I'm going to tip in this vellum. 
So let me set that over to the side. Where's my, oh, there it is. I could not see my pencil mark. All right, so. Let's get this. Cut down. tip this in so when I see this I know I'm fixing to um, I need to make it just a smidge shorter because when the book closes it's gonna push it out so let me cut it down just a little bit more but anyway each time I see one of those I'll know that I'm fixing to change into a different section. This don't have like a paper grip on it to where it can be easily kept in place. Let me see if that's enough. Yeah, I think that'll do. Okay, let me see if I can get my paper rounder to recognize this. Yes, round the edges. And then I need my tape. So this can be done several different ways. If you watch Plan With Me, you know that this is one way that it can be done, but there are several ways it can be done. You can get double-sided tape that's not very big at all, um, width-wise, and run it down the side make sure yeah all right where's my car here's my car we're gonna roll this back and I might have to make two videos, y'all. I might have to do my um, decorating the actual pages. In the next video, it just depends on how long this setup is. But it will be coming next if I have to do a... Lord being my helper, I'm not going to leave this spot till I get this planner all done. Something so fun about putting in a new planner, um, fixing a new planner. So then I need to go to where the weeks start right here. So I'm going to tip in this blue here, I think. So... Let me come off that page just a smidgen. We're going to mark this. And then I'm going to come in just a little bit and mark this.
I get so excited about these kind of videos, but then I get so nervous too, because I'm like, I don't want to mess it up. Let's see if this here, this don't look like it has quite a straight edge. Let me just straighten this up. This is from where I cut something else. I've used this little page more than once. So, okay, that's fine with me for it to be like that. So, get me three little pieces of tape. And we're going to take this vellum in. You don't have to use pieces of tape as big as I did. You can use them smaller. But anyway, once you get it tipped in, that's the way it looks and does. All right, then I'm going to go to, so this starts my weeks, and then I'm going to go to where my notes section starts, back here. And I'm going to put the smiley face one back here. All right, let's cut it down. that it's fine this way it's still a little long that way I need to cut underneath that little line so Looks better, the cut does. Let's see. When that book pushes out. All right, hang on, let me cut down the other part. Okay, so this one I really got shorter than I wanted. But it's back here with my notes pages, so it'll be okay. It's still cute. So there's those. And let me see if I can get this big sticker from Shine Sticker Studio on here. Because I think that's going to be so cute right there. See if I can do this without messing up. I 
Okay, y'all. Cute. I like it. Okay. So then, 2024. Like I said, these came from my shop. If you want some of these, they should be up in the shop. Let's see here. I'm going to put this down. And there's a lot of shops, not just Shine Sticker Studio, but Pookie Bear Cuties and um, Sweet Kawaii Design. Several shops that have the these full pages that you can. And that would also be a Hobonichi Weeks size sticker all right yay okay so now let's see here what I want to do. I want to put a little something here in this pocket. Let's see. What can I put? That'll work. Veronica's freebie will fit right there. Alright. And then I've got some stickers from Timu who don't have stickers from Timo. These are adorable. And I might can just, without putting them on my vinyl, she might stay there. I might have to add a, um, piece of tape to the back of her? I don't know. Okay, so we'll play with that and see how it works. Then... I'll come back in just a minute on a different video and we will put in some of the stickers for the week and the month. Um, but here's what I've done so far. Those two pages are going to get taped together, I can just tell you. So we tipped in the year at a glance on this and then we tipped in where the monthly starts, I mean the weekly start. And then I tipped in where my notes pages are going to be. Alright, so if you liked this video, give me a thumbs up, subscribe, and we'll see you on the next one, guys. Bye-bye.